Welcome back everybody to another episode of Bob's Garage and today I'm going to show you how to install an ECU and a B5 Audi S4 and the process is very straightforward. It's uh, basically you just remove the um, cowl cover which is the plastic cover underneath the windshield wipers. For some reason I always have problems removing my windshield wipers. They kind of get bound on and I can never tell if I need to close the hood to get them off or open the hood to get them off. I don't know, maybe it's just me. So after you uh, remove the wipers, then you can remove the rubber trim piece that seals the engine bay, and then you can pull off the cover right off of the uh, uh, top of the box there. All right, so here is the new box. It is a 8DO 907551L. So this is a 2002 Audi S4, which should be an AA box, and uh, but this L box should be compatible. This is from a 2001. So, right. so I bought this chip used off of eBay, and uh, from uh, my research, I'm gonna post a link down below in the description showing uh, a ca compatibility chart for different ECUs for different years makes and models of the Audi S4, but uh, my car is an AA box, this is an L box, and it should swap right over. They both require the Hitachi mass airflow sensor, and it's just five bolts to get into the ECU box here, and then uh, after that, you can pull it out. All right, so stock one is 8, 8D0907551. AA. And I just wanted to make a note that I had come across something that said to remove your ECU you would have to uh, drill out some special screws or security screws. I did not see that as the case for my 2002 Audi S4. Now um, if you do have to drill out those screws it shouldn't be too bad to uh, uh, replace it afterwards. I think you can either use like some push pins or something along those lines. Mine just had a metal bracket holding down the ECU. I just simply used a screwdriver and pried that metal hold down bracket out of place and then I was able to pop out the ECU. So then there's just two little locking levers that hold the wire connectors to the ECU. You pop out the lock and you just keep pulling on it and eventually it'll pop free the entire wire loom from the ECU. So very straightforward. It's only five bolts. This process takes about 15 to 20 minutes or so. So let me know if you have any questions. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. There it is, kids. Geoc X chip, stage one, 17 PSI, in a 2002 Audi S4. It's a uh, L chip. The stock chip was an AA chip. And uh, we just did the data logging. And uh, she said it turned around. Definitely. Excellent. <laughs>